This is the 100 megawatt Redstone Concentrated Solar Thermal Power Project, located 200 kilometers from Kimberley, South Africa. It is a renewable energy project jointly constructed by China and South Africa. South Africa has been actively promoting a low carbon energy transition for several years now. Indeed, the country is well placed to do so, benefiting from a number of natural advantages, including abundant year-round solar resources. Clayton Michael Rod is a mechanical engineer working on the Redstone Power Project. Today, he is performing the final inspection of the pipeline system before the chemical water commissioning test begins. Naturally, he is feeling quite stressed. The principle of molten salt solar thermal power generation involves using heliostats to reflect sunlight onto a receiver at the top of the solar tower, where the energy heats the molten salt, converting light energy into thermal energy. This thermal energy is subsequently transformed into kinetic, mechanical, and ultimately electrical energy. Chemical water serves as a vital medium for energy transfer and exchange, ensuring the reliable operation of the entire power plant system. Yes, we, we are finished, but we just want to run the pumps mm -hmm. on its own for about yeah, yeah. two hours, just to check if there's any problem, also to check if it's going in the proper uh, direction for rotation. 就像我们平时日常生活中用的开水壶一样，那些水都是未经过处理的，经常会发现有很多水垢。这些对于我们这个机组的还有系统的安全运行是有很大隐患的。所以说我们需要将这些杂质啊，还有一些不必要的元素，